digital audio is not a continuous wave. It is thousands of tiny snapshots of the sound taken every second. So you have um, 44.1 kilohertz, which is 44,100 snapshots per second. And then you have 48K, which is uh, 48,000 snapshots a second. Uh, 44.1 kilohertz is the standard for CDs. If you were making an album in 1995, then this was your number. And um, 48 kilohertz is the standard for video. Uh, things like DVDs, broadcast TV, movies all use um, 48. Choose 48 kilohertz. Here's why. Um, you're likely making content that will end up on YouTube, Instagram, or TikTok. Video platforms prefer 48 kilohertz. If you record in 44.1 and try to sync it to video later, um, then the math gets messy. You can actually run into sync issues or quality loss during conversion. For pure music, 44.1 is fine. These days, Spotify is probably the only one that uses that simple rate, but for everything else, uh, 48K is the modern safety net. Never change the sample rate in the middle of a project. If you import 44.1 files in a 48 session, it will play back at the wrong speed and pitch. Go to your audio interface right now and lock it to 48 kilohertz. Tomorrow, we're talking about bit depth, 16 bit, versus 24-bit. Spoiler. One of them is a complete waste of time. So see you then.